Hi everyone, this is Yanis here. I'm just behind the camera. I'm here because I want to show you my tiny bedroom where I'm making some noise. And this is indeed a very small room. It's no big one. Uh, it's, it's less than 10 square meters. It's just uh, the size enough for my equipment, not, not, not more. As this room used to be my son's bedroom before. Um, now I can show you something what is behind. I go one window here. Uh, let me turn my chair as my camera currently is attached to the um, studio chair so every time showing you I have to move either forward or backwards this is the window and uh, here is another chair so this room normally is uh, very dark and every time when I need uh, to do some work uh, around the music I have to turn upper lights or even for this filming I had to take even extra more lights from uh, somewhere else so I can do some filming here as you can see I have a di digital piano and uh, let's 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 move forward closer to my desk so I can show you what's what is there as you can see I, I have a couple of headphones uh, my favorite ones and this is from Bayer Dynamics uh, BT770 Pro and the other one is from Audio Technica I think X50 I forgot exactly uh, the serial number then I have on the table uh, studio monitor interface which means all cables are connected to, the, to that big machine I have few mini uh, MIDI keyboards let me move a little bit back so you can see more from here so this this small one from M Audio. then I have Akai MPK MIDI then I have another one which is here so I have to pull it out so you can better see that ski station I think uh, 61 uh, here's another uh, device uh, on the desk control 2 from Korg which is used for my automation if I have to do or work around dynamics uh, let's turn and move forward again uh, so I, I'm keeping or saving all of my sessions or stamps on my external drives one is two terabit another one is one terabit uh, capacity those uh, being synchronized in between in a case one is failing so I can always uh, reach out to my files then I have another interface which is which is right behind there let's let's go this way uh, this from M Audio fast track interface that's the very old and uh, I think it's very outdated so I have to upgrade either to Apollo or Scarlet on, on this interface there's sitting another box uh, Phantom that's for my condenser microphones uh, let's go a little bit left and uh, here you can see uh, my guitars, this is acoustic one which can be plugged and recorded if I need there is another electric one uh, which is hanging on the wall uh, right behind them there is stand of microphone which is used for my demos songwriting and uh, on the floor is a pedal pedal board which is for distortion for electric guitar or some fancy effects uh, this what I have here let's move back again Let, let's show you my speakers uh, so I have a pair of M Audio speakers which are just behind my monitor those are very small ones and those are my very first ones speakers when I start out with uh, music production currently I'm using them for mixing uh, those are like reference speakers and then I have a pair of uh, Adam Audio A7 uh, those ones uh, which I'm using for my master tracks or mixing also and uh, I can complain about them so this is all what I got here uh, guys if you have something what you want to share with me you got your experience with your bedroom studio or something else just drop some comment and uh, I'll be happy to see your blog your lifestyle your experience uh, working around this and uh, of course uh, my studio is ending up with my 
acoustic panels because when I moved in, uh, the, here was very high reverberation and uh, this room was echo and I had to put some acoustic panels on the walls, which I did. So there was some treatment, but of course it wasn't enough because I still felt this room is quite wet, I will say. Then I had to do some extra work and buy some other panels, uh, uh, hanging them on the ceiling. Uh, they are here, I got three of those just above my head. And now this room is less or more uh, fine for any music production. Uh, thank you guys for watching and um, take care. See you later. Bye.